guys and welcome back to my channel and to on another haul video this haul is just going to be this part it's only a few things i've got a lot of animal crossing stickers along with a new planner i think i'll go through the planner first and then i'll go for the stickers um yeah i'll do it that way so i'll just put them over there for now so i have been on a hunt for a new kind of like pre-planner i have currently been using this one is just from a random shop and I just use this to write down all my like plans I do for the day before I put them in to my let me put my uh, my actual my old planner that I mainly keep in um so yeah so I need to know these because this one runs out when does this run out end of July yeah I think it starts in July I think I don't know I'm not too sure but yeah so I need a new one of these so I was looking and searching and I came across this um this brand company um box clever press and I'll leave the link to the website as well as this link to this planner that I got off Amazon it was 10 pounds Came in this box, cute box. I mean, it was a bit bashed up because, like, you know, Amazon. And it's a 20 to 21 planner. And what I like about this is that it's a, vert a vertical. Now, it's so similar to my memory keeping planner, it's similar to that. And I like that. I don't think stickers, no, um, the that won't be able, I won't be able to use kits I might be able to like, put some stickers in this like character stickers and stuff but when it comes to like panel kits it won't do which is fine I guess um, but I found this very appealing the vertical layout um, I've been looking for one for a while so yeah so I'll just go through the panel with you so you've got the yearly overview and then you've got the goals and dreams for the year and you've got the book like this this page what is plans for the year and you can write in what your plans are then you've got so, so a few pages which are talking about big projects which i guess is it's good it's like got details complete completed it um, by um total budget which i think is good especially if i was like filming stuff maybe um then it gives you one the last week of july and going into august here so i might kind of like do like a little mock spread here i don't i'm going to do a pen test in a bit i'm going to do the pens that i normally use and then you've got the monthly overview. Now in this planner, this planner was a, it's a vertical planner and this doesn't never had the monthly overviews at all. Um, it just went straight into the actual, um, into the actual week, which I actually quite like this. I could maybe use it for like budgeting or like bills and stuff stuff which i do like at the start of each month you do get a date and your bills and you can tick them off to let you know that you've paid them and then you've got plans for august which i like and then you do get have the weekly so you have kind of like a sidebar of like to do like checklists of what you need to do for the week and then you've got your actual weekly planner which again is vertical as I've said and you get three boxes so it's similar to the planner that I plan in with my stickers but so it'd be good for me I could uh, write down like stuff and I can know how it will look and fill my old planner which I like and then you've got down here it says goals for the week and then you've got that kind of like a little monthly <laughs> overview here and then that goes in all the way to July. Each um, month has like a different colour scheme. Then at the back, 
you do have some note pages that are stock grid pages and then some more um, goals and dreams for next year another plan for next year for I think it's 21,000 and then you've got some important websites I can write down all my sticker shops that I like maybe useful numbers you've got like doctor, dentist, optician, vet, local police, home insurance car break down, insurance, car break down, garage, school, hairdressers, baby cell, stuff like that and then you've got a 21,000 2021 um, yearly view and then you've got like and then you've got this kind of like pocket in the back that I could pop in like some stickers but yeah that's my new um pre-planner you also get like a little pen I was going to do like a little pen test one there but yeah this is my new pre-planner I've just done the important ones so I'm going to use this this and Maybe the simple girl. I um, think we got it once we've lost the thing, and I'm just gonna write down how I will normally write. It's kind of like a, like a nice, soft, smooth. Um, paper. So that was with the once my love pen. I'm so bad at writing. This is the paper mink paper mate ink joy which i always struggle with anyway like a lot of people get really good handwriting with this i don't and then you got this g2 pen which is my favorite so that's what it kind of like a pen test looks like but yeah anyway so that's my planner my pre-planner for this year I might change it up when it comes to the uh, 2021 but I will see how it goes so uh, yeah, I might go to a ring binder or a binder that or oh, I can plan with stickers because I do like planning with stickers and stuff like that and this one doesn't give that up it, well, it does but like it'd be kind of hard to do it but that's from Bots Clever Plus. I'll leave, like I said, I'll leave the links below to that. So that's that. Now in two actual stickers. So my first shop is Lily Lily Blossom. Okay, this is my yeah. Sorry, invoice for it. Um, I picked up two of her summer kits. I think she was having a sale on, not a sale, I think she, it was join a sale because I got all these freebies, I know, I've wrecked it. Oh, um, and I'll go for all the freebies, which are so cute. So, I'll get the two big ones out of the way, the two Paper Shire freebies. I love Paper Shire, I haven't ordered from her in a while, I keep adding stuff to my basket and then not buying it. But these look so cute. You got like this fall doodle sampler, which will come in handy in the fall when that comes around. And then you got this large spring sampler. This switch. This is the reason why I want to buy from her because I always put I always put all the animal crossing um, stickers and switch stickers in the basket, and then I just forget, or I'm just like thinking, do I need? stickers because like you know i should be like saving up and not on, an, on a, a no spend of stickers as you can tell it's not working but yeah i love the switch sticker so this is kind of her large um sampler so that was from paper shire then you've got this sampler from is it upside down it's upside down from the ginger cat co so cute you've got like a mug i'm guessing that's one of her character stickers netflix wins maybe next time some books laptop a laptop um some ice cream and a lazy day sticker you've got this sticker here i think it's a hobonichi um sampler for the planner print fab planner print that's what it's called sorry and yeah it's got like some date covers for like date numbers is it gonna like date covers whatever you want to call them 
um, for the Hobonichi, which is cute. Then I've got this sampler from Wendy um, Prints, like a full box, and then some functional stickers. And I've got this sampler from Paper K. I like her paper, very cute, and I love her. St I love her like character stickers. I might need to go and check out her shop. I love it when I get samplers from other shops because then I'm like, ooh, I'll check out this shop and this shop. This is the adventure, is it? Adventure of Bosco, I think it is. So I'm guessing it's characters of this wee doggy. So cute. And then you've got some um, script stickers. Then you've got a sampler from Tulip Plans. Again, a very functional sampler. Definitely use these. A sampler from Paper Chic Plans. I love Paper Chic Plans. So I'm happy I've got like a, a nice little sampler from that. Love these boxes. Another um, a sampler from Mac and Grey Designs. So you've got some glitter headers and then some of her kind of like characters and doodles. Got this one here and it's a lot, a lot of samplers. I'm loving it. Um, Thumbelina prints and it's this kind of like some um some self care stickers like so I'll take a bath get some fresh air magazine biscuits and a cup of tea escape with a TV show go to bed early and list your priorities love that um another sample from ambitious mini I think it's called ambitious plan sorry and it's got some of her marshmallow stickers along with um, some script stickers of birthday, payday, plan and sim calls. And again, nice paper. I got a sampler from Lodgin Styles, another shop that I really do like on this channel. Again, but I haven't ordered from her in ages, but I got this cute little sampler from her. Then Bella Plan. Bella Planella, I think it's called, and then so some of her stickers which she sells, some doodles and some of her character stickers. And then last one, I got one from Le Pretty Paula, I think it is, and then it's got um, a sample of every um, one of her character stickers she does. I was gonna say, there we go, which is so cute. And that's all. The freebies and the samplers I got from other shops amazing love that definitely will go through them and put them in my sampler um book sticker book thing then I did order two kits from her now I thought one of these kit came with foil because it says pick your foil and I picked rainbow foil but I'm guessing you might have had to like add that on I'm guessing which yeah, I don't really mind. So I picked up two kits. I picked up two summer kits, which you, which definitely has a place in my collection for this year, probably. Um, I did forget this um, fifteen pounds plus sampler along with this sampler, which. I'm guessing goes with this kit so I'm just going to put it with this kit and I'll show you with that kit but this is the 15 plus sampler with some full boxes and then I'll go through the first summer kit this is summer story um, and this is just the June freebie but it fits with this kit um, it's got the same quote box but it's fine I will use definitely use the bow head and um, bow head so I'll keep that with this um, kit so this is summer story and this is very bright colors i love this very much and her kit for the deluxe i have my invoice here so i can check the price for you and for this kit it was nine pound fifty but she was having a disc that she was having a sale on um nine pound fifty yet yeah. and I get got the glitter headers sampler as well which is two pound i'm gonna cover up my address but look it says i don't know i don't know if it like it means 
that I needed it to get the foil but like I paid £14 oh it's gonna focus I can do it this way I paid £14 for the or Mac kit and then it says please choose foil and I put rainbow I'm guessing you might have had to add it on I'm not too sure but it's fine um but yes I got the summer story kit and we'll go this is the deluxe kit and I know I don't go for deluxe kits but she doesn't do a mini kit version and to be fair I don't really mind um for the price you get quite a lot so yeah these are full boxes again the bright bright colours I do love very much you got your um, checklist this yellow is super bright I love it and then some boxes at the bottom you got your washi page with an extra full box and some washi strips and just the brightness and then you got this page with your date darts and a date not date darts so date covers some sidebar stuff some build juice and some more um squared off boxes along with some appointment labels you can burn out and some icons um, another functional page with some loads more boxes along with some deco and some checklists then you've got your headers page along with some more boxes i'm dev i could definitely do a no white space plan with, um, my space plan with me with this which is definitely going to happen and then you've got your glitter header sampler which was an add-on and i bought this separate so that was the summer story kit love that i'm gonna put this here then i did pick up the ohana um lilo and stitch um inspired kit because i love lilo and stitch and i couldn't say no to this um kit at all and this is i think this is bigger than the other kit um because i paid a bit more for it and um, i think you do get a bit more i think you got the glitter header free with this along with the deco so maybe that's what bumped it up to 40 but i'm not too sure anyway um i'll just rip through this so these are the four boxes your checklists your functional your date covers your washi page and your extra full box your manual function page with some squared off boxes and then your checklist and some deco oh, that's upside down um your headers page along with some more boxes and then you did get a whole page of deco which is so cute and you can let a header sampler i love this purple and blue together it's so beautiful so that was the ohana kit and that's everything i bought from lily blossom designs the next few orders are basically animal crossing stickers so yeah um that was the only non-animal crossing related stuff i got so i got a uh, order in from paper sheet plans um yeah she's been doing a lot of flat lays recently and um i picked up some of her new flat lays she was having a sale on again and she, was, she had a big release she's bringing out some pins like and i'm so excited for that and this is from the rosalie plans i'm guessing this is her sampler to go along with this um i'm guessing um yeah it's just like a little add-on in the order for, for promotion and then you did get uh another sampler of like her flat lays i think i don't have any of these because that's budgeting that's planning i don't really have a rings planner but when i when i do i'm gonna say when because i'm probably gonna get a rings planner um that will come in handy and then lazy day and then i'm gonna and then some pizza then i did pick up some of her flat lays some like a lot um she did a release of her switch ones i'll show you the switch ones first because that's the main reason why i ordered from them 
and I'll show you the other ones that I've just picked up inside but she does have three for two I think it is you buy one you buy two and get one free I believe um, and it's it's so good so she did a few colors so she did a yellow switch overlay which is so good for when I'm playing Animal Crossing because I play Animal Crossing quite a lot and it takes up a lot of my time <laughs> which is fine and I'll and I'll love and I love that I could just put that flatly down and that you'll know that it's an about Animal Crossing. I got the blue ones and all the like different colours would be good. It will match a lot of like spreads. I got the grey ones and then I did get the cool ones. So I think yeah, you basically get all the variations of the, the, the switch light you can get. I don't have a switch light. I have <laughs> the normal switch, you know it is, a bit dirty. Um, I'm, I'm guessing I'm still on, yeah, I'm still on Animal Crossing. I'm just, I was talking to Itoko there. She's my newest, she's my newest villager. <laughs> um, but yeah. Uh, but I'll definitely use these and I'll definitely, every time I probably buy from her, like purchase some stickers from her, like some kits, I'll probably just add some of these onto it. Um, just because I like to stock up. Then lastly I did pick up um, four more of them. I got these beach ones for like walking on the beach whenever I do that. A scenic route for like road trips maybe. Picnic because you never know, I might. You need you might need them one day when I have a, when I have a picnic, and then some stickers that I could film that I could like use to, like film holes to mark that or like to mark that like, loads of like happy mail or just like loads of sticker buying. Um, but yeah, that's everything like, from Pippi Cheek Plans. A little small order from her, um, just purely flat A's because yeah. I think I've got all of her newest kits. She's got a new kit coming out and it's the Monsters Inc. University but it's like back to school but I'm not going back to school but I really want it. I don't know what I'll use it for though. Um, then I pick and then I did pick up some stuff from the Blossom Nose Co. I haven't ordered from her in ages. She was one of my very first shops I ever ordered from as well when I started planning. And then I just didn't order back from her again but then she brought out all these like Animal Crossing stickers and I'm here for it so right. Ooh. Ooh. so it came in like this cute little packaging um, with her like kind of branding on it which is cute then you got a journaling card which is a very nice um, a sturdy journaling card, love that. A little message, um, saying thank you. And then this one is a very cute, it's a um, little um, rainbow. Oh, it says this too shall pass. I'll definitely put that in my planner. So, this is what I bought from her shop. I bought two a die cut and a sticker. The sticker saying switch bitch. <laughs> There's so much stuff that I wanna actually my friend's birthday's coming up and like I feel like she will appreciate a die cut like this. I might go back and buy this die cut and something in here where I'll show you um when I get to it. So I got this die cut, not die cut, there's a final sticker. And then I got this die cut saying I need space. All of these will be going into my Oh, I am tempted to wait until I do get a, a rings pan and like decorate my pan up with them. Oh, I could just buy them because these are, these are quite um, inexpensive as well and they're so nice. Like the quality, look at that. Beautiful. Then I did pick up a few of her stickers because you know love them i picked up her animal crossing pink icon stickers so you got the leaf the coins the nook miles ticket the turnip the speech bubble i'm guessing the fossil and the bells i don't know what they are i'm not too sure i'm guessing it's like when the cat when when one of the villagers wants to talk to you or something i think and then i picked up two of them 
then I picked up two of the Switch controllers. Um, I love how like neutrally pink they are because normally I do have pink running through my um, kit so it'll be easy to incorporate these. I picked up two of her work schedule stickers. I love these. These are so like simple and dainty. I am definitely probably going to go back and purchase some of them. I got a book, a but first ice coffee script sticker. I uh, I need space sticker. A sleepy head stickers. Some bye bye money hello stickers because that's me right now. I've been buying so much stickers and like not enough saving. And then another book first coffee, but the normal coffee. And then oops, I bought stickers again. And yeah, so that's all of that. And like, it's so nice. Like, I, I forgot when I last purchased from her, but she, I do love her stickers. I'm definitely probably gonna go back and spend more money on them. But that's from the Blossom Nose Co. Again, all the shops will be linked below. Um, then that's all that it is for the UK shops. The next two shops are international. Um, I got a, a haul from Planning Roses. This was a while ago. Um, I bought, purchased these ones. Um, and then I got pay, and I got Child Customs, and I was like, oh, okay. Um, because which is which confuses me because I feel like Customs is meant to be like only over a certain like amount and I didn't spend a lot of money on this and I got paid I got charged 13 pounds nothing to do with planning roses and her and like any um and from her side it's more just like import importation and everything like that so it's fine it's fine I was just surprised that I had to pay um in um customs for this but anyway you got a gel card that says the best is yet to come I love this very much and along with her business card which again it's so cute and professional and then i did pick up some of her animal crossing things so i picked up oh, i'll just sort these out already right through them so i picked up some um three sets of her animal crossing script stickers that she was um doing a foil i think this was like the release of the animal crossing stickers i bought these she was doing foil for these but i decided to just go for black um because that will fit in most of my spread because normally i don't really do foil i bought some switch the smallest switch icons in all the pastel colors so cute love them very much and then lastly or lastly but i bought the bigger ones as well which are kind of like half box sizes so i could like write in what i did in animal crossing or something like island hunt or like flower breeding any of them cute again they're in the same kind of like pastel-y colors and then lastly from planning roses i just picked up the payday icon stickers because i think these were on sale and i thought i'll just pick these up and yeah have them for like to mark paydays and stuff um so that was just a tiny little haul from planning roses cute shop then this came today i was so happy it's from Lil little planets mm. little planet papery this shop has literally became my biggest one of my favorite shops ever so cute like the stickers are amazing and stuff and everything this was my latest order which was the Animal Crossing release where she did the passport. This is what I'm talking about. This is what I think I might need to get my friend for her birthday. Um, is like the whole passport bundle. I bought a kit and then I bought some more little stickers. But again, you do get this journal card with Baby Yoda. I don't know. I think I've got like four of these now, but I am not complaining because like these will, one of these can go into my memory planner and then one of them can go into my room frame planner when I get it. When? When? Don't know how. Don't know when. I'm gonna get one. Um, let's go through the non-animal crossing stuff. I don't think this was a sale or anything. I think it was a, a release of a animal crossing 
bundle. Um, I'll go through the samplers first. So you got her little sampler, um, a little die cut of like a mail cart, and then another one of these like kind of book um, Phoebe's where you fold it up and then put it in your planner. That was the Phoebe's you got from a little planet and um, papery. And then I got these girls book boss and now I've seen her about and but like she does like the tapes, don't she? Um and then you've got like a little free overlay. I'm not gonna probably use it, but like it's so cute and I think it's sparkly gold hollow. And it's like the stars, which is cute. And then you've got like a little um, business card from her. I might use it. I might. Um, anyway. The kind of like little sheets I got, I got another one of these Happy Mails sheet and stickers because I was, I've been loving her little character stickers because they're so tiny and they fit so well in the planner. I picked up two of her Switch stickers because you know I've been playing the switch a lot and I need to build up my switch sticker collection which it has grown it has grown got some Etsy love heart stickers got some TV stickers these are quite big compared to what I thought they would be I thought they'd be a bit smaller but it's fine I'm not doing much these days so it'd be good to have big stickers to fill my planner and I did pick up the Pokemon this character sticker sheet. I've already picked up the kit of the Pokemon kit. If you saw my last haul, I believe it was in. Um, this one is definitely a cutie one. I just love the Snorlax. I just want uh, a whole sheet of them Snorlax stickers because I love Snorlax. So that's uh, the kind of like character stickers I picked up. I'll go through the kit before I go on to the actual kind of like Animal Crossing bundle because that's just like the favourite, my favourite part. So the kit, I was thinking, do I use this kit this month? Because I'm doing uh, my favourite things for the for the month of June, um, because it's my birthday uh, month, and I really want to use kits like to represent things I love. And I've already used the Animal Crossing kit. And I've got my last week, I've got Alice in Wonderland, my birthday, like the, my birthday kit, which that plan me should have been, was, it had went up. I've got an Alice in Wonderland themed, an Avenger themed, and then the last week, I don't know. I don't know how to use an office or Pox and Rec or do an old um, Animal Crossing theme. Not too sure. Anyway, this kit, so cute. This is called Animal Woodland, and you've got all the full boxes. You've got like, all of these five could be a quick box. So you've got the KK slider, you've got the welcome back where like when you're flying in <laughs> to your village after visiting someone, you've got the museum, you've got the nooks and cranny, and you've got Isabel. And then you've got kind of like just some um general animal crossing four boxes, which is so cute. I love this kit very much. And then you've got your function sheet with like some headers and yeah, like kind of glitter headers. I love this pattern. Headers, I cannot wait to use them. Um, some sidebar stickers and then some little things. Your checklists, which I'll probably cut down to, to use as labels or little things. And then some checklists. Then your half boxes and quarter boxes and stuff. And then some more checklists, some icons on that sheet. And then you got your washi. Look at this washi, guys. I'm so I'm in love with it. I'm not gonna cut this up and use like simple gilded washi, or I'm gonna not probably overlay it with anything because this is super cute. And then you got your date covers, and then some hydrate stickers in your weekend banner. And then you've got like a little deco sheet here, which I'll probably just put into my Animal Crossing um, part of my character sheet and um, my in my character binder after using this kit and then you've got another sampler of like different date covers and then there's some more hybrid trackers another weekend and a flag i think i would actually use these ones is it these ones these ones and um, date covers 
but yeah that's the animal crossing themed kit and then so that was one of the reasons why i purchased from her and then the main reason was this this is the bundle i could have bought it in separate but i wanted the passport because you know i love it and it's so cute i'm definitely going to probably purchase if they've got any left i'm going to probably purchase one for my friend for her birthday because i could actually person oh, personalize it i'm just gonna break everything there we go just shove this back up like that there we go and yeah so you got like that is a little passport and you could put your picture in your name the date issued your island's name and then your island's fruit so i had to pin off a picture of myself along with links out that's so cute i love it very much it's like kind of foiled as well and then in the sam in the actual bundle you've got the turnip um, what do you call it? Paper clip. I love it very much. Like turnips are the stock market of Animal Crossing. You buy turnips every Sunday and then you can sell them for the week. And people's islands is way um, um, either really cheap or really expensive. Um, you got the die cut. So you got the die cut of the welcome um, back. Um, sticker the nook sticker these are all like die cuts the isabel one the kk slider the focus and then the museum oh wait wait i'm sorry and then for the sticker sheets of the bundle you've got again you've got all of them um but in sticker form You've got kind of like the net, the trees, um, the axes, the bridges and the shovels. Again, for like terraforming or like just sorting out your island. Oh no, they're not, bri <laughs> they're not bridges. Um, stumps. A little bit of bridges in the viewfinder. Um, then you've got this one with the blooms, the, again, the leaf the bells, the fossils, the we person you need to pay for a bridge, I forgot what they're called, and then tents, and then you just got all the fine fruits you can get, the cherries, the peaches, the, the apples, the pears, and the oranges. I My um, native fruit is the apples, and my native flower is the tulip, if any of you guys wondering and that was the animal crossing bundle from little planet papery and that's everything for this haul i hope you enjoyed it i'm just going to show all the stickers that i've purchased right here um so i can do a little thumbnail for my video there we go but yes if you enjoyed this video please give me a thumbs up please subscribe and if you want to see all these stickers in action and this planner i might do a video on it separately to see how it actually goes i might do an updated video in the in the next few months anyway but yeah see you guys bye